Hello at Excel students, the 8 mark examine question. It's going to come in all three of your papers, in paper 1, paper 2 and in paper 3. It doesn't matter in which paper it comes, it's exactly the same style of question. It's a KAA E question, so it does require evaluation as well and here's the breakdown of marks. Two marks for knowledge, two marks for application, two marks for analysis and only the two marks for evaluation. So it's not one to stress too much about. It's an eight minute question, right? So you don't need to write a huge amount of stuff. Very simple with the structure, which we're going to go through in a second. In papers one and two, it's going to come in section B of your paper. In paper three, it's going to come in section A and in section B. So you're going to have two of these to do in paper three. Right, all you need to do is to write down two KA points and then two evaluation points. One for each KAA point that you mentioned. So simply two paragraphs done perfectly with all four key skills and you've got your marks here. How do you make sure you get it? Well, for knowledge, what are you looking out for? Identification of two factors or two reasons. See what the question says. Identification of two factors will get you two marks for knowledge there to start each paragraph. Maybe definitions as well. It's always an option for you for knowledge marks. For application, use the extracts. That's why they're there. You know, Find something in the extract to back up each uh, point that you're looking to make here. Just make sure that whatever data you choose, whatever uh, quotation or something that you pick from the extracts is relevant to the point that you're making. It's got to back up whatever point you're looking to make here. For your analysis marks, you're looking for chains of analysis. So explain your theory in chains. Explain the point you're making in chains. Every uh, thing in that theory you've got to methodically explain to make sure nothing is missed out in that chain. There might be a diagram for you to look out for which helps you with your analysis too. If you do use a diagram, make sure it's drawn accurately and make sure that you refer to everything that's happening on your diagram in your writing too. That's the way to get analysis marks there, just make sure everything's explained in a chain. And then for evaluation, you don't need much depth of evaluation at all. So simply stating an evaluation point for each paragraph. So for each KA point, state an evaluation point and you've got it. Uh, application might help you. So the extracts might give you something there to evaluate or you might want to evaluate with some application to back up your evaluation point. But simple evaluation for each KA point and you've got your marks for evaluation. A very, very simple question in paper one, two and three. You should be getting eight marks, no problem. I'll see you all in the next video. Thanks for watching.